Hello everybody, it's Biva from Bohemian Crafting and I will try to share with you this journal I made. Uh, I'm trying it probably for four four times. Uh, I think my camera or my memory card are just struggling somehow. So I'm not sure which which one is wrong, but I tried to take this video before and it was failed all the time. So I'm gonna try it again. Uh, I made this beautiful small journal. It's small, but it's very thick. <laughs> and I had this idea in my head for a very long time. We are using coffee or tea dyed papers in our journal. Uh, and as I am coffee lover, I drink coffee all day long. Uh, I wanted to try to make some coffee and friends theme uh, journal. So this is what I made. It's coffee theme, coffee and friends. Uh, I know that name of the journal, it's not showing up, <laughs> but I like this name, I like that sign, so I had to place it just on, on that cover. As you can see, I used again uh, leather, but this is not proper leather, it's, this is fox leather. I used this time uh, for closure, I used this chain, it's a huge ring here on the front, same, it's on the back side, and for closing, I'm using this, oops, this clips. Uh, I used few charms on this chain to make it pretty. And uh, inside of my cover, I use this beautiful lace which my mommy sent me. It's really vintage, so I use it here on all all that cover. It's covering with this with this beautiful lace, and here. On front side and also on the back side of that cover, I made like a pen spot, stencil pencil spot. You can slide your pen, your stencils, pencils. <laughs> what is it? It's pencil <laughs> behind this piece of leather, and it will holding inside. I used coffee dyed papers in this journal, and I used few ephemeras and vintage pictures uh, about coffee theme in this journal. I used loads of them and also I used coffees. <laughs> I include coffees in this journal because it's coffee team. <laughs> so they deserve to be there. Uh, it's it's thick exactly just before all those coffees. I believe it will be a little bit more comfortable without those coffees when they coffees will be take out. So this is my first page of this journal. Uh, I used uh, Martha Stewart border punch for this journal. Not for all pages but for uh, many of them here uh, paper doily coffee dyed paper doily this is my first tuck spot i used uh, some coffee postcard and this is type of images i used in this journal of uh, a lot those are that modern vintage pictures which i really like they've got that beautiful beautiful power that uh, you can see that that vintage the feeling so I use them in this journal as well. Here, that other half of my tuck spot and some tuck. I used lots of stamps in this journal. Paper doily. Here I made small, uh, small envelope. It's nothing inside yet, but I hope uh, I will have access to my compu uh, computer, to my printer today. Hopefully, we had. Uh, huge damage in our house from water uh, from leaking pipes so I couldn't be able to get to my computer to my room <laughs> my room it's still a huge mess behind me <laughs> so I will uh, have to make some reorganization and when I will be done I will probably make some small tour again because uh, I start to building my own uh, shelves for my craft uh, craft supplies because uh, I've got empty places between a wall and my my rooms uh, my, my uh, storage storage shelves where if I will have to buy some some other shelves it will be difficult because it has just a measurement difficult different measurement so I will build it up myself this is that quiz which I include in this journal it's for fun you know when we having talk coffee we, we would like to have some relaxing time and this is brilliant with coffee here another tuck spot uh, tuck 
again coffee theme this is a um, vintage Eiffel Tower uh, ephemeras which I include because I've been in Paris it's a long time ago and I had their coffee and it was brilliant so I included there this is another piece of paper I include some extra space for journaling and here coffee and friends yes again paper doily extended pages it's huge space for journaling in this journal here I used uh, those CD CD covers in this journal and this washi tape it's from my lovely friend Elena she sent me in her with her uh, Christmas uh, Christmas gifts so I saved this washi tape because it's beautiful and I've got it in in this journal here first sign I found uh, I've got many more in my computer but I had no access to my to my printer so <laughs> maybe maybe hopefully I will print it out today here I use that Tim Holtz uh, Tim Holtz dies for this uh, I use for, for, for this love sign I use this piece of acetate like embellishment and I make small tag it's like uh, it can be used like bookmark and here another that modern vintage picture this beautiful camera here I've got ladies on coffee time and here I found this coffee menu coffee many sign and there is many different style of styles of coffee and also how to make them here uh, Tim Holtz coffee stencil this is Tim Holtz stamp some tuck and here is my first coffee I included in this journal this is latte this is latte coffee some tuck with stamps here a small postcard and here is another sign about coffee and friends make the perfect blend yes that's totally true here is a uh, coffee dyed uh, heart doily and uh, I used for this sign I used uh, Parisian style uh, stencils uh, stencil I've got this is book uh, book <laughs> page from book I found jokes uh, book with jokes with many jokes and so I include one page here <laughs> and it's really gorgeous and I, it's so fun to read that so I include it in this journal here is another beautiful modern vintage <laughs> style picture and this is uh, my spoon spool thread spool I made for my stuff uh, as I said uh, I will try to organize my craft supplies so I, I'm making those spools and I include one here maybe I will put around some coffee dyed ribbon or coffee dyed lace maybe I think here is another sign from this Parisian stencil I purchased and here it's another coffee I include in this journal it's Nescafe 3 in 1 and it's really yummy 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 this beautiful vintage uh, ephemera again pages with stamps here I made a kind of tag or tag, tag booklet or what is it it can be used again like bookmark just put your pages in it and it can be used like bookmark here this uh, book page with coffee sign and I would like to think uh, I let oh my camera again struggling uh, I let dry my papers on those heating radiators and all heating radiators have this uh, this pattern on the top from those rips and uh, that coffee take that pattern and now it it is like mm, coffee <laughs> So I have to place this page right next to that one. I make pocket behind and I include that this beautiful picture with family. They probably having tea, but I included here because we are using tea and coffee for dyeing all papers. Oops. Another stamps. Uh, here I include few ephemeras like this one. This one. And also picture of our capital city from my country of Prague. 
It's beautiful, Sydney. Prague is really very romantic and very old. And I made a very small notepad. And because I'm living in England, I had to include those. <laughs> this is proper English. This is proper English. Keep calm and put the kettle on. <laughs> I love that. And this picture, it's totally amazing. Look at that cup. Look at that cup. <laughs> I wish to have them. <laughs> I wish to have one. I need my morning copy, uh, cup of coffee cup of coffee <laughs> it's totally me <laughs> so i included here again some stamps it's coffee stencil and here i've got another coffee that one is latte this one is mocha mocha coffee which i include in this journal here i use that corgurate uh, corgurate cardboard like a basic of my pocket here is another spoon my handmade spoon with espresso sign and with this beautiful picture here those ladies on coffee break some tack and this ephemera stamped images here caramel spice coffee with uh, including uh, ingredients which you need for making this coffee stamps here I made it's kind of like tax spot behind this uh, vintage advert so you can slide something behind those beautiful ladies this is from paris picture here uh, in this cd cover i made it like a pocket and i include those ephemeras i really enjoyed to do this this journal it was so fun here is another piece of that beautiful washi tape from elena thank you so much elena it's beautiful washi tape and here i would like to show you uh, i kind of uh, upgraded upgraded uh, that can pouring paper clip uh, i made it like magnetic i will show you i made it like magnetic paper clip Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's holding so strong. <laughs> I think I use very strong magnets. So if you will want to know how to make those, and I made it in a, a little bit different style as well, in kind of shabby chic, I just wanted to show you that it, it is possible to make it like shabby chic. So if you will want to know how to make those, <laughs> it's really strong. <laughs> just let me know, I can make some small tutorial how to make them it's it's not too hard to make it here another beautiful image some extra space for journaling and from other side i would like to show you what i found uh, i found those valentine's postcards it's not with coffee team but that postcard is really beautiful it's selby abbey and all those post postcards had this uh, it's like protection so i included here I've got my paper paper clip <laughs> here another beautiful uh, beautiful sign from that Parisian stencil uh, Tim Holtz stamp and here another images this is that modern vintage and this I really love look at them look at those ladies they they look like coffee mafia <laughs> so I had to include it here <laughs> in this pocket Paper, those beautiful ladies on coffee break and here is another extra tag or pocket with this beautiful modern vintage picture and also with this picture I know it's not coffee there but it's in kitchen and I really love this picture look at that dog <laughs> those both <laughs> this reminds me or some <laughs> I don't know why maybe because that's there <laughs> So I have to include it here <laughs> because it's amazing. Another coffee dyed papers, those beautiful ladies and uh, coffee dyed postcard behind. And here another images, this stamp, this girl having coffee and another beautiful modern vintage. And we are nearly on the end. This is from that Parisian stencil, it's really amazing. 
and here I've got that another one another paper clip as you can see this is uh, this is the uh, canopy ring and I decorate it with the ball and with the heart and with this bead and it's magnetic as well from other side I've got this filigree with same uh, same bead from both sides so this is my another paper clip with this stack with this ephemera and with this beautiful picture and we are nearly on the end here is another piece from this beautiful uh, washi tape this extension and this is totally last pocket in this journal again this coffee three in one beautiful picture and in this pocket I've got last two pictures this beautiful coffee coffee and those girls <laughs> I know they don't they don't have coffee they've got probably tea but they are so cute <laughs> so I included them so this is my sharing for today I really hope this video will be uploaded if not I don't know I don't know I really don't know I will have to descri describe it on my blog uh, I hope you you like my journal I really hope you found some inspiration Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you will want to know how to make those paper clips, just let me know and I will try to do a small tutorial. Thank you so much for, for all your amazing comments. And have a lovely day, have a lovely Sunday and see you soon. Bye.